Texas school threatens to arrest parents who walk their kids to or from school. To most parents, the safety of their kids is the most important thing in the world, which is why they don't ever second guess when having to take a decision that would protect their children. Now, when it comes to school, it's already well known most parents accompany their children and wait for them to enter to study. In most cases, they also show up once classes are over and wait to pick them up. Usually, there are many ways in which parents can get their children to school. Driving them with their cars or having them take the bus are only a few options. But those who live by rather just walk. The practice applied by parents of walking their kids to school has become somewhat necessary. So much so that if children were to walk alone, the number of things that could go wrong would be big. Not only would they be susceptible to becoming victims of bullies, but also to suffer from other risks, getting hit by a car while crossing the street, or being targeted for kidnapping are just a few. Some kids live a few blocks away from school, so taking the bus makes sense. However, for Texas Bear Branch Elementary School Principal Holly Ray, that's exactly what everybody should do. Kids should take the bus to school regardless of the distance there is between their homes and the study center. But doing so is completely optional, right? Well, as much as we would like to say it is, the Texan school has actually issued a policy prohibiting parents from dropping off or picking up their kids by walking. In other words, if a parent wants to pick up their kid, he or she has to do it by car or simply wait at home while the school bus does its job. According to Principal Holly Ray, the goal of this rule is to have an improved safe dismissal process. And even though some parents don't agree, the rule has come to stay. So what happens if you decide not to abide by such a rule? Well, you can literally get arrested. As ridiculous as this sounds, trying to walk your kid to school can actually land you in jail. Incredibly, the Texan school has the full support of the police, and it's even been reported Principal Ray has convinced officers to be present during the pickup and drop-off hours. This way, if a parent dares to break the rules, he or she can get arrested. So far, only one dad has been giving a trespassing warning, but the fact that Principal Ray has managed to do such things has outraged the rest of the parents to the point of making the issue public. Wendy Jarman, mother of two, contacted Fox News and explained how many parents were forced to either have their kids ride the bus or wait for them in long pickup lines. According to her, school principal Holly Ray is forcing parents to wait inside their cars in order to pick up their kids. And to make things worse, all bike racks have been removed to assure young students only get to school by car or bus. But why though? Well, there's no official answer on what the reason is why Mrs. Ray has applied this rule other than improving the dismissal process. But some people believe it's because the school is located near a busy five-lane highway. If we see it from that point of view, then we can say the school principal is trying to protect children from getting hit by a car while walking. But then again, being transported by a car or bus isn't always that safe, as they can always collide with another vehicle. While Mrs. Ray claims to have implemented this rule to protect kids, parents believe her policy is implying they don't have the ability or capability to decide what's safest for their children. As for the pickup lines, it's known parents have to wait about an hour to be able to pick up their kids. For those who live just five minutes away from school, waiting one hour is clearly annoying. Fox News also reported parents sent their complaints to the school principal, but all of them were ignored. Due to this reason, many kids have been pulled out from that school. But things don't end here. Employees weren't happy either. So as a sign of protest against the controversial rule, many of them resigned. The school is now losing not only students, but also teachers. As for the threats to arrest parents who don't go by the rules, there are two sides of the story. Police officers are indeed allowed to make an arrest if a parent decides to walk their kids to the school. But to this day, no one has actually been apprehended. Now, remember the father who got a trespassing warning? Well, turns out he'd gone mad and started yelling at teachers outside the school while kids were watching. So, as you can understand, something had to be done. Finally, given that this issue became public, people decided to give their opinions. Some agreed with the principal and some questioned the rule. But overall, you could see more support towards the principal's decision than disapproval against it. As always, determining what's right and what isn't is up to the way you see things. So tell us, 
What are your thoughts on this case? If you have kids, would you agree with a decision like this? Let us know in the comments below.